Après trois jours d'échantillonnage scientifique dans la baie de Galway en Irlande, Dara s'apprête à y passer une semaine d'escale. L'occasion pour l'équipage d'échanger avec le public, mais aussi de découvrir les traditions maritimes de la ville. En entrant au port, on passe devant l'ancien village de Clada, où vivait une communauté de pêcheurs. Leurs embarcations anciennes font partie du patrimoine historique de la ville. Rendez-vous au Hookers Club pour en savoir plus. My name is Kieran Oliver, Commodore of Galway Hooker Sailing Club. So the, the, the purpose of the hookers, they were designed for work boats. They were designed for necessity, to feed, feed families and children, to be used for the transport of goods and cargo. So Galway was a gateway to Europe. We were importing wines and spirits and teas and spices on tall ships. And we were exporting fish also that was caught in the Galway hookers. But the goods that came into the city, you know, were distributed across the county, along the coast, in hookers. And then, uh, so the goods would go to Connemara, and there they would pick up turf. They went to the Iron Islands, and they gave turf, or swapped turf, or sold turf, and then they got fish, and then they came back, and the cycle just continued. Retour à terre, où nous allons maintenant retrouver une artiste dont le travail s'inspire de l'océan et tisse des liens entre la science et l'art. Hi, my name is Louise Manifold. Um, I'm a visual artist and I come from Galway. So Aerial Sparks was a project that involved bringing seven artists on the Marine Institute, the Irish Marine Institute's research vessel, the RV Celtic Explorer. The artwork, its major focus was on sound. Life on the ocean waves. Science um, can only communicate um, a particular set of, of material, which is reliant of data. Um, but we as artists have a role as, is that we have an ability to communicate in a way that can um, impact on how other people feel and think. Il est temps maintenant pour l'équipage de reprendre la mer. Nous laissons derrière nous l'Irlande et les îles Aran pour filer vers la Bretagne. <musique> 